Steph just had a 90 minute run down here in Mexico. How'd that go? Yeah, it was okay. You know, we it was good to see uh, um, some good competition um, and obviously uh, change the rules uh, in terms of how you ha handle goal kicks and playing out of the back. So we've introduced a few new things and uh, and uh, they they changed their approach uh, as well throughout the game. So it, it made us think and adapt, um, which was really good. So. You know, recognizing where the overloads are, recognizing if they're man-to-man, -man, that we have strengths up top with uh, maybe an under-hit ball to roll, or, or, or Jordan is, has a good size, Christian is strong in the air as well. So it's just recognizing these things and, and, and having good spaces. So that for, for that, it was a really good exercise. Uh, and then the fitness level, obviously, as well. I think you could, you could see in the second half that we were struggling with that. But uh, it's, it's a good mental uh, lesson because every game will have its ups and then downs where you are absolutely gassed. So the question is, how do you you know, get through that spell. What, what are you going to do? I think we should have maybe adapted a little bit better there uh, just to, to, to see whether we can make them run, get them a little bit gassed, and, and for us to maybe find our second wind a little bit better. You've been down here for about a week. Uh, how different is it actually playing a match compared to just the training sessions? Oh, it's a completely different fitness. Um, you know, you're talking about fitness in, in, a, in, the, um, in the gym is one thing, and you're talking about... Uh, um, soccer fitness, uh, we're doing no training and then I think there's a completely different fitness uh, for field players as well as for goalkeepers when it comes to games, you know, I mean, I'm, I don't have too many touches, but uh, there, there, there cannot be mental lapses for me for 45 minutes, so it's a different kind of fitness you're talking about for play field players, obviously it's, it's the same thing, so uh, uh, you need to get these minutes under your belt um, and, and it's always good, again, to, to not have intramural scrimmages against your own squad, but, but see new things and, and be thrown off a little bit and having to adapt. That's what soccer is, right? Um, it's a fluid game where you have to adapt and, and, and improvise um, and do the best with what you see. Um, and so it's good to see uh, different teams. Uh, knew who was going up and down the flank. The center backs were, uh, were in together. What did you see in your back line today? Good, great. Um, it's also you know, a matter of getting, getting proper communication uh, started with obviously uh, Jamar um, in, in the back. Um, you know, we had a couple of practices now where, where you heard me say your way and he thought that meant keeper. Um, so it's really getting on the same page and, and starting to understand that vocabulary. Um, I think we're, we're expecting um, Javi to, to take a little bit more of an initiative when it comes to uh, organization and, and the commanding presence in the back. For example, if you know uh, the opponent goes negative, goes backwards, can we go and take a couple steps? I'm always trying to uh, to to be the guy that says that, but you know, if we're gonna be in front of 43,000 people at home, uh, people are not gonna hear me. So uh, it's a it's a matter of really gelling uh, and, and and realizing what are our key. Um, our key moments uh, that we chime in and a neg negative pass okay that means we got to step up things like that um, are important to 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 gel and, and to work on as a team as a back four as well last question for you it's always nice getting an assist right yeah always nice to get to to get on the board and uh, no i mean uh, it, it worked out well again look like i said it's a uh, it's uh, the, the thing I think I'm most happy with is, is uh, understanding and reading the situation in that play. Uh, we want to play out of the back. We want to maintain possession. But if a team is pressing so high and they're one to one, um, we played it uh, quite well there with uh, Jordan giving me a, a, a small little signal. Uh, and then me asking uh, Raul to really come check hard to have that guy bite and then uh, launch it over his head behind. So again, it's one of our strengths, you know, Jordan is fast. And if teams aren't gonna uh, respect that, then we have to, to see if we can punish him.